Hello, um, I'm going to show you all a quick demonstration of how to use Stop Motion Animator. It is a Google extension, um, so you can add it um, through Google Chrome. Um, so this is kind of what it looks like. There's two versions of it, so you, on newer um, Google Chromes, um, there is one other version that looks a little bit different but similar. Um, so. I'm going to show how to do this and how to set it up. So I have a water bottle here and I suggest setting it up against a wall. Um, you can set your setup and if you want it to be a little further away, you can pull your computer away. Um, so I'm going to start on this side and have the water bottle move. So I take my hand off to the side. You might want to work with a partner. So one person is moving and one is doing the hand. And I'm going to be pressing the capture button. When you move the water bottle, you're going to notice something called an onion skin, which shows where the water bottle was before. If you move it too quickly and not little small increments, um, it's not going to look as smooth. So for example, if you were to put your hand here and take a photo with the hand in the picture, this app does not allow you to go back and edit. Um, you would have to go and edit in a movie editing app, but you could press the undo button and then continue to capture your photos. Now, this is all I'm going to do today because it's quite tedious work um, to make a longer video and you don't want to watch all the little steps, but we'll do this for the day. And out of the frame. Okay, so let's play it. Um, we're going to play this back by pressing play. I currently have it in the middle, um, so if I want to go slower with less frames per second, I'll go a bit slower. You can see. Or if you were to go faster, the thing is the video is a lot um, slower, like a lot um, shorter. So I would suggest to go maybe about this much or in the middle. And then we can record audio. Um, this app does not allow to go in and you know find a bunch of audio. So you could potentially play some royal free royalty free music um, at your computer screen, or you can record your voice doing sound effects by pressing record. So we'll press record now. Okay, and we play it back. Perfect. Um, another thing that you want to keep in mind um, when you're using this app is um, saving. So to save, you go to save, call it moving water bottle. Okay, and then it will save. Um, I'll save it here, save. Um, it saves into your Google Drive. Um, so you can use the link um, and put the link up um, on to like giving the link to us to save it and then send to your teacher with the link or we could put it up on YouTube. I might make these videos as a compilation. Um, and then you can also load videos. So if you've saved a video, you could load a previous video and then add to it this way. So that is an option. Um, but if we want to do some more complicated things, we could use a movie editing app.